nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, ignition. And liftoff of Starliner and Atlas V, carrying two American heroes, drawing a line to the stars for all of us. Commander Butch Wilmer there calling down to Mission Control here in Houston that the spacecraft has begun rolling into the right attitude for its asset and the guidance navigation and control officer here in the room seeing good data on that. Looking good with speeds and attitude increasing as expected. Coming up in less than 20 seconds, the solid rocket boosters will run out of fuel and burn out. Good SRP burnout. Good SRP. Now the fuel in the solid rocket boosters has been depleted. The Atlas main booster stage will be continuing its burn for about the next three minutes. Good handle. Good handle. That, that call, good handle from Capcom Joshua Kutrick, indicating that the crew now has the ability to initiate an abort manually if needed. All looking good so far. Now two minutes into uh, Starliner's flight and coming up on the solid rocket booster jettison at the two minute and 40 second mark. Good trajectory. CLG. The solid rocket boosters have now been jettisoned after seeing Starliner through its first 90 seconds of flight. Team on the ground here confirming that it was a good jettison and that the vehicle's trajectory continues to look good. Now uh, three minutes into today's flight. Atlas Booster now throttling back to limit the G-forces on Butch and Sunny, uh, trying to limit that to around three and a half times the force of gravity you would feel while on the ground.
Agent, to hear in the ground. ECAL is open. You have sublimator on. ECAL, sub -act. ECAL. Great act. Team on the ground reporting that they saw they saw the ascent covered on top of Starliner that's been protecting the, star, the spacecraft's docking system through its climate to orbit. They saw that jettison as planned. Staging was good. You have good control. Yeah. 